thank you so much for watching. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Amrita Jambal and I make motherhood and lifestyle videos. Um, before we get started, if you can hit that red subscribe button and that thumbs up, I would really, really, really appreciate it. Um, but yeah, let's get right into it. So um, if you have not bought your toddler or you're you know, buying gifts for your um, niece, your nephew, your friend's kids, um, and you're a little confused on what to get, um, I'm here to help you out. So this is everything that I got my toddler, my nephew, my niece, and these are good for boys and girls. So I hope this helps you guys out and let's jump right into it. All right, so first I have this um, little Tykes lawnmower, um, and this is for my son. He is really into like lawnmowers and <laughs> things like that. When people, um, when he sees people cutting their yard or when he sees somebody come to cut our yard, he gets really excited. So I got him this little Tykes a lot more. Um, I just think it's super cute. It comes with like this little um, like refillable little gas tank thing. Um, just fun play stuff. Um, I feel like kids this age, he is two and a half exactly, um, and I feel like kids his age really like pretend play like you know toy like things that are real like food, um, lawnmowers, things that like you know they actually see on a daily basis that are like in toy form. Um, rather than just like bright lights and things like that on toys. That's just what I observed that they like that kind of stuff. So I think this would make a great gift. And I got this one at Target when I was there. I saw it and I thought it was the cutest thing and I had to have it. So this is the back. And it's just really cute. All right, if you have a toddler, boy or girl, I'm sure they've seen or they are obsessed with Paw Patrol. My son loves Paw Patrol. It's one of his favorite things. Um, to watch. So Paw Patrol, I saw this VTech watch um, on Amazon and I went ahead and got it for him. Um, it says ages three to six. Um, I think he'll just really like having a pretend watch. Um, he's like into playing with like if my husband's wearing a watch he wants to mess around with that or um, I've just seen him be into like my niece sometimes wears like a little pretend watch and he likes to play with that so I thought this would be a cute idea um, I think they're just like there's games and features on here I don't think he's actually gonna play any games or features I just think he will think he's cool to be a watch and you don't need batteries it's Paw Patrol watch, super cute, and I think any kid would be excited to get this. They had it in different colors too, so if you have a girl, you can get like red. Um, I'm not sure if they had pink, but I remember them having red as well. So my next gift idea for any kid, boy or girl, puzzles. My son is starting to get into puzzles now, um, and my nephew has been into puzzles. So I got this for my nephew. I don't think he has this one. It's the fire truck um, floor puzzle basically a huge puzzle that you lay out on the floor and they piece it together. Um, I don't know if there's an age on here. Oh, age is three plus. So yeah, my son, he kind of does like one or two pieces and he's like, okay, he gets kind of distracted. But my nephew is really, really good at puzzles. So I hope he likes this one. And then the traffic jam, I got this for him too, but I found out he already has it. So I'll probably just be giving it to my son. Um, it's a traffic jam puzzle. so. It has like bus, police cars, a dump truck, stuff that he's really into anyways. Um, so yeah, I think they'll be excited about that. Next thing I got my son is something that I saw at my sister's house that my son likes to play with. Um, magnet tiles, um, or magnet blocks, I'm sorry. But they are like little tiles that you kind of, you can put together and make different things. Again, they get to use their you know imagination to kind of build things. They're kind of like the, little um, Lego blocks, but they're magnet. Um, and I don't know, he seemed really into it. So I went ahead and got one. I got this off of Amazon. It says ages three plus. Um, yeah, perfect to play on the go. So I guess you can also take this with you different places as well. So yeah, I think this would be a great idea for, again, a boy or a girl um, ages like three and up. Okay, so along that same line of um, building and blocks and whatnot, I got this for my nephew because I don't have it. It's called the Picasso Tiles. So they're basically brushel 
bristle shaped 3D building blocks. So they're made of bristle, so they'll, um, it's just a different texture that they can build things with. Um, and he also really enjoys building, so I hope he enjoys this. Um, it comes with 120 pieces. But yeah, so if your child likes building and things like that, this is just something different um, that you can give them because they're different than Legos. They have like a different type of feel to them as well. And I will link everything down below, guys, for you. This is from Amazon. Okay, so getting into a little bit more of a girlier gift. If you are gifting for a girl that is about five and up, this, well, this is three and up, but I don't think I would give this to a three-year-old. It's a DIY jewelry making kit. My um, niece is really into jewelry. So <laughs> she's really into bracelets and necklaces and all that. So I got her a DIY jewelry making kit. I thought this would be super cute for any girl that's like, I would say four and up um, to make your own bracelets and their necklaces and all that. So that's what the box looks like. And this again is from Amazon. Most of all my gifts are from Amazon. I have a couple from Target and Costco as well, but this was Amazon. Okay, so I'm gonna stay on the theme of girly gifts. Um, I got this for um, somebody, um, not my not my niece, but um, for a friend's daughter um, who is into Barbie as well. My niece is into Barbie as well, and I did get her Barbie stuff too. But um, this is um, Barbie's Princess Adventure, and it comes with like Barbie, a little dog, even has a little iPhone, and like shoes I think that's a crown so just like a little accessories um, I thought that was cute I guess I don't really know much about Barbie because I'm a boy and just not really into Barbie but and then I got the holiday Barbie 2020 um, she just looks like a pageant Barbie <laughs> to be honest she's wearing a big fluffy dress her hair and makeup is all done and she has some long earrings but yeah I thought that, that's just cute and again I got this one from Amazon that's the back of the box so yeah, I think um, Barbies are always, uh, you know, a surefire hit with younger girls. So um, yeah, I would definitely recommend this. is six plus and three plus on here. So I don't know why this one's for six plus and this one's for three plus, but I am gifting this to a four and a half year old. Four and a half? Yeah, four and a half year old. So yeah. So continuing on the girly theme and the Barbie theme, I found this at. Uh, Costco. Costco guys, if you were looking for like unique gifts that you know they won't already have or that they're not already getting from Amazon or Target because a lot of times you buy things, this happened to me last year, I bought a lot of things on Amazon for my niece and nephew and my sister did and then they ended up having like a couple of the same gifts. So if you're looking for like unique gifts that other people won't have or things like that, check out your local Costco because I found some really cute things. Um, I found this Barbie set. I thought this was so cute. And this is a gift for both of my um, nieces that they can kind of share. So it comes with a Barbie car and it comes with two, whoa, I mean, sorry. It comes with two Barbies and it comes with a helicopter, um, which I thought was super cute. And then the Barbies have accessories. And usually, I would think this would be really expensive, but it was about 50 bucks. It was like 49 or 45 or something like that. So I thought that was cute. Oh yeah, the Barbies. Okay, how cute. The Barbies have, um, let me not like break my leg. <laughs> the Barbies have a uh, little luggage. That's so cute. So they're like going somewhere and they have a helicopter. So I know that they will be super excited to get this and to play with it as well. So that's really big. It's like kind of but yeah, Costco guys, check it out at your local Costco. Might have this stuff. Okay, so this is another gift. I think this is gender neutral because my son also likes playing with this. I've seen him enjoy playing with this. It's basically a picnic basket and it comes with um, different shapes, I think. And it teaches you shapes and colors. And it's just like a cute little picnic basket. I was gonna get one that had like um, a teapot. That's what actually my son actually likes playing with those little big cups. Um, but they, she already has some, but I would recommend that as well. So this is like a little picnic basket um, that teaches you shapes and colors um, and it talks and it's by Leap, Leapfrog. Leapfrog is usually pretty good with like educational toys for kids. Um, but yeah, this is for my little niece and she is almost two and a half. She's about two months younger than my son. So 
So um, yeah, and I gift her this. So um, this gift is more for like an older child. I would say like four or five and up. Um, it gets gender neutral. It could be for a boy or a girl. Um, I got this because my niece, who is going to be five soon, loves taking pictures. Like she will get your phone and just like pretend like she's a little photographer. She loves taking pictures. So I got her this kid's camera and it's an actual digital camera. Like it, you can connect it to your computer and like all of that. You can even capture a video on here. So I thought that was really cute. I think she'll really enjoy this. It's like a real camera and she gets to take real pictures with. So if your kid's into taking pictures, I think this is a really cute gift idea. All right, so this I got for my younger niece. Um, she, again, is almost two and a half. Um, my son has some of this stuff. We didn't get this exact one for him, um, but he has like a pretend blender and a pretend um, like stand mixer, and he really likes it. Um, it keeps him entertained for a good while, so <laughs> my sister didn't have one, so this one comes with a toaster, fake fruit, a little mixer, a blender, um, and like two cups, so, um, yeah, this is really cool. It says ages three and up, but I think a two-year-old would also have fun with this as well. And I got this one from Amazon. So the toaster, it actually turns, you can press it down and rotate the knob. The mixer actually has little things that blend. And then same thing with the uh, blender. So yeah, this is great. And then on here it says it teaches life skills, role play, hands-on skills, shows social skills. Um, a cute gift for any kid from two to like four. Okay, back to the more boyish um, gifts. I got this for my son. It is a top truck, I believe, and it comes with like a little tool thing in here. So it says junior crew, teaches shapes, colors, tools, fine motor skills. Um, He's really into dump trucks, and my friend actually already gave him his Christmas present, um, and it was a toolbox. So it's kind of like this, but he's been really into that. He's been playing with that um, every single day since he got it. So I'm sure he's gonna love this because it's a dump truck and a tool thing. Um, so two of the things that he really likes, and I found this at Costco. Guys, like I said, Costco is a great place to find <laughs> gifts. I know that's so weird, but it actually is. Even for older folks, or if you're looking for like a gift basket or something to send somebody, they have really great options as well. So, um, this is what the what it looks like. You can see it without the glare. Um, but yeah, this is an awesome toy because I find most boys are into like construction vehicles, like dump trucks and excavators and things like that. And he's really into that. So, this is a great toy. This next toy, um, so... I got this for my son and my nephew. I got both of them this because they both are really into garbage trucks, especially my son. Oh my God, he loves garbage trucks. I'm sure if you're a mom and you're watching this, you know about Blippi and he loves Blippi and he loves a garbage truck song that <laughs> Blippi has on his channel. Anytime we're driving and he sees like a real garbage truck, he gets so excited. So this garbage truck right here, it's huge. Um, I think it requires batteries, but it does make noise when it uh, backs up or when it goes forward. Um, and then you can put, it comes with a little, um, yeah, it comes with batteries too, so that's convenient. And it comes with like a little blue garbage truck in here that you can just put right here and then do this and it opens up and you can put like little things in there, pretend trash and kind of put it in here. Um, and it opens up from the back as well. So this is like a super, super cute gift for any little boy that's into construction vehicles, garbage trucks, things like that. Um, okay, so my next gift is for a younger child. Um, I would say, I mean, it can, it, it's a gift that kind of grows with your kid, which I thought was really cool. Um, we got this for one of our friend's um, kids. It's a Skip and Hop, which is a great brand. Um, Skip and Hop 3-in-1 Ride-On. So there's three, three stages. First is, um, it's a walker for when they're learning how to walk. And then it goes into like a little rider for intermediate, um, intermediate, uh, you know, kids that are just starting to walk and that can kind of use a toy. And then it turns into a scooter um, for older children. And I thought that was so cool and unique. So you can see it here. 
so it starts out as a walker and then you know they can ride it and then it turns into a little scooter so this is something that they can have um, for so many years down the line I think this is a great gift because it grows with your child and I think that's awesome that's what it looks like soup and hot and I want to say I got this from Amazon if I didn't it's on Amazon it's either Amazon or Target I believe it was Amazon though um, and I'll have that linked below for you guys this is a really cool gift one of the gifts that I got my son that I think he will be in love with I'm so excited um, is a like a garbage truck that's really big that he can actually drive around it's a recycling truck and it comes with like a little recycling bin in the back that you can like put things in I'm super excited to give that to him I couldn't fit it in here it's not already built or anything but um, I will go ahead and put a picture up for you guys so you can see it um, and I think this is a great great gift it is a little bit more pricey but if you're just getting that one special gift for your kid or for your niece and nephew or somebody that's really into like garbage trucks like my son is, I think this will literally make their Christmas. So this is one of the gifts I'm so excited about gifting him and I will link that down below as well. I got mine from Amazon but I know they have it on Target.com as well. Alright, so my last gift is a little on the fancier, higher end side. Um, it's for my son. So my son we started giving him the ipad um a few months ago i want to say like a couple months into the pandemic we started giving him an ipad and, um it's a really old ipad like we've had it for years like 10 years now um so it's really really old and it's slow um and so I, we decided to give him a new ipad and we've been limiting his screen time especially on the um, like devices so like the ipad and stuff to only like 20 30 minutes a day um, but we still wanted something of good quality um, and not something like that freezes all the time. So we had to order one anyway. So we're like, let's just order it and give it to him. So it is the eighth generation iPad. I don't know much about iPads, but um, apparently it has a lot of like learning activities on here for children and it comes with like a little pencil. So that will help with like fine motor skills and stuff with him like pretending to draw or trying to like write and things like that. And I think this will grow with him. Of course, we have to keep a track of the pen because we lose 90% of things <laughs> that are his, especially like things that he has. But um, yeah, you have to probably keep track of the pen, but it comes with like this pen. Um, and uh, I heard there's a lot of cool kids activities that you can have on this iPad that come with the iPad, like drawing and writing and all of that. So we try to download most educational games for him to play um, rather than just watch YouTube um, I don't really let him get on YouTube by himself on the iPad it's all he plays um, a lot of different games on there we have a couple of Sesame Street games we have a Daniel Tiger game um, uh, the Khan Academy kids that's a really good app um, but yeah we try to get more educational and I'm just excited that he'll have something new and something fast um, even if it's only for like 30 minutes a day, which I'm sure we'll get more time as he is older. He's probably going to want it more. But yeah, guys, that is everything that I got for Christmas for my nephew, my nieces, my friends, um, kids. Um, I did get clothing as well, but I don't think anybody really wants to see that. It's just clothing as gifts. Um, but I know that people struggle, especially if you don't have kids or you don't really know what to get like an older kid if you only you know you only have like younger kids or vice versa so I hope this video helped you guys um and if it did please 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 hit that thumbs up, up button and that red subscribe button I would really appreciate it and thank you guys for watching guys Merry Christmas Happy Holidays